Well, hello friends. So I was thinking what to make next and I certainly got a cool idea. So as you all know that government has included a fast tag in our toll tax system in which you don't have to pay cash and you can pay the toll digitally which makes the system and the transportation more easier and much faster. So I thought let's make something similar to it which doesn't need a lot of human effort and it is also a fast solution. So I made this a toll tax system which doesn't need any human effort and, and it is also a faster solution. So welcome back to our channel where we love to explore the world of DIY electronics. And before starting the video, I want you to please subscribe my YouTube channel as because only 1.5% of you have subscribed this channel. So without any further ado, let's get started. Now let's talk about the component. So the first component is the Arduino. You will need a small servo motor. You can use a bigger one as well if you wish. If you wish, you can use this big uh, breadboard or a bit smaller than this one. But as because I am not using a lot of components in this project, so I am going to use this one. I am using a HCSR04 ultrasonic sensor and few jumper wires. This is the circuit diagram for your reference. So finally I have completed the circuit of the project. You can see I have connected the ground and 5V of Arduino to VCC and ground of these two components through jumper wires. And this is the advantage of taking these kinds of small breadboard. Now let's move to the coding section. So this is the whole code, so you can see the eco pin and the trick pin and this part of the code is also known as the defining part because we are defining uh, the pin numbers to send and receive signals from the modules. And in this part, we are assigning the eco and trick terminals, the time duration and the distance parameter, which we will use uh, during the passing of the cars through the toll tax system. And in this part, we are setting up the servo horn lifting angle and the response time. Now let's verify the code. So we have verified the code. So now let's upload the code in the Arduino and as you can see the light is blinking so the code is uploaded. So I have kept the ultrasonic sensor here and the jumper wires connecting it to Arduino. This is our servo motor connected through the jumper wires to the Arduino. The power source, the power bank and I stick a chart paper here and wrote toll on it 
so now let's test it let's take our first car the ultrasonic sensor senses the car and it opens the barrier and when it passes it it closes the barrier immediately now let's test it with third car as well yes it passes so that's all for today's video friend i hope you have learned how to build this project and if you have any query related to the coding part or the circuit part of this project you can comment down below i'll try to answer it as soon as possible and please don't forget to like share and subscribe to my youtube channel and i meet you in the next one